Man, it's so unfortunate because I did mention it in the last video when talking about our top strikers. So these are the strikers to watch next season. I really hope they remain in the clubs that I say. Otherwise, this would just be a complete blunder. Complete blunder. But anyway, other than one striker who just signed with Task FC, the rest, well, they're a bit, it's a bit uncertain. But with the transfer window still open, you never know. You never know. They'll just move in and out. But anyway. And so, with that in mind, Elvis Rupia might be leaving the country and going to Tanzania, uh, joining a Tanzanian-based side. And so this is pretty, pretty sad actually because I had predicted that he would win the 2023-2024 Golden Boot Award uh, for the K I mean, FKF Premier League season. So this is actually pretty unfortunate, but uh, it's not yet confirmed. It might be confirmed later on during uh, later on in the week. And it's also dependent on now what Kenya Police FC actually say. So they're the ones to accept or deny uh, the players' move. So more news on that, though that's quite unfortunate. But we have more for you, so stay tuned and let's get it. So game week one of the FKF Premier League, it wasn't high scoring. But we got it underway. We had to start. We had to start. And uh, the first 2023-2024 FKF Premier League goal was actually scored by the new signing, Benjamin Mosher from Ulinzi. Uh, he took the lead versus Nzoya Sugar. As we mentioned, the first game week wasn't that high on goals. But we still had drama, late goals, late penalties, red cards and whatnot. Uh, I think the biggest one was actually the one from Murana Seals, late goal. Uh, versus Shabana, uh, newly promoted club. So that was the one nil win from Ranga Seals. We had FC versus Talanta, nil nil, Costa Rangers versus Bilko, nil nil, Nairobi City Stars versus Muroni, nil nil. But they had a 90th minute penalty, it was missed. Uh, we had Gormaya versus Sofapaka, which was 1 1. Uh, the champions were goal down and so had to score the equalizer. Zoya Sugar versus Olaze Stars, whereby we mentioned Benjamin Marshall was the first, uh, scored the first goal of the 2023-2024 FKF Premier League season. Uh, they actually lost because Zoya Sugar came back uh, to win the game 2-1 and so taking maximum points from being a goal down. But Daddy were beaten by 10 men, Tasca, one nil. So the two clubs who have looked to sign quality players, Kario Bangi Sharks and Kenya Police, ended up in a nil-nil draw. When it comes to players outside the country, Joshua Lopago was once again on target for Dynamo Brest in the Belarusian League. We talked about him in our, our other videos and he managed to score the winner uh, ending the game 2-1. When it comes now to sad news actually, to me, this is sad news because I'm like, what, how, why? I, I, Premier League clubs and such, homeboys, continental journey, it came to an end with a 4-1 beating. Uh, but to, to be honest, you know, this preparation is everything. Uh, I talk about preparation because it was revealed actually that homeboys traveled with 15 players and they only had three, they only had three outfield players on the bench and maybe those are not even the players that you really want you know like if we're being completely honest uh, coach patrick odiambo had 15 players at his disposal uh, in libya and so i feel like this contributed to their loss the first the first leg was actually nil nil at home and then they went and were beaten 4-1 it was 3-1 by half time and i think this is just down to just down to preparation apparently some of these players weren't able to get tickets uh, so it was the technical bench and uh, a number of players and so which is quite unfortunate to see a club uh, such a huge club with so much potential because this is technically a big club locally it's now regarded as a bigish club now it's, it's growing so it's a it's a big club locally so it's actually quite sad that they were not able to to push further and i think it's just due to preparation and uh, yeah just management anyway thank you so much for tuning in this has been well, that's been that for today's video. Do make sure to check out our other social media platforms at LFB Love Ball. Thank you so much for watching till the end. As we mentioned, we do have other segments such as LFB Mondays and Tutorial Wednesdays. And so, yeah, just just in case, just in case you like our content, and uh, of course you like our content, otherwise you wouldn't be here, man. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much again. Stay tuned and uh, support Kenyan. Food. We out.